Um, if I remember correctly, within 48 hours, we had over 20,000 people that had viewed the deal. 84,000 views, 162 actions, right? That one only ran for a week, as you can see. We can rerun the deal if we want. This one, 378,000 people. I saw it or something. You know, it's pretty, pretty great branding, I'd say, right? And then 287 actions. So, Grow your cleaning business. Make more money. Have more time. This is the Profit Cleaners Podcast with your hosts, Brandon Condry and Brandon Shane. Hey everybody, Brandon Shane here with another video for you guys. Thank you for checking it out. Uh, we're just sharing with you guys on this video how behind the scenes kind of look. We're growing our local cleaning business, leveraging the power of next door and leveraging the power of local deals, local word of mouth. Uh, next door is a pretty cool platform. If you guys haven't checked it out, it's sort of up and coming in, in some markets and some of the smaller markets. It's mostly in the, the bigger markets, I'd say. Um, but we've been testing it a lot this year, and I just wanted to show you guys kind of what that looks like. First of all, let's just look at what is next door in general. And this, this, uh, here's the sales page for it, you know, so next door for local business, the only place for your business to connect to your most valuable customers, people in your neighborhood. So this is what I love about next door guys is it's hyper local which means uh, you're going to be able to get super local, like we'll, we'll take a look here in a second, but basically to the point where you're uh, in, in specific neighborhoods, not just zip codes or a radius like you can do on Google or Facebook, some of those, but <clears throat> it is free. You should definitely sign up an account on Nextstar if you haven't already. See, these are the local deals, right? So uh, I just, I just want to show you guys how powerful these are. I want to actually dive into one of the recent campaigns we did. Um, but you can do neighborhood sponsorships, which is cool too. That's a little bit newer. Haven't tested that just yet. Um, but it's just such a great way to brand your business locally, get in the door, uh, free business posting. So you can actually post, if this is what it's talking about here, you can post two free posts a month to the entire neighborhood, which is really cool to the entire network of neighborhoods in your local area. So, um, essentially how it works is once you get a review in a specific neighborhood, you're going to show up now in that neighborhood and people can organically find you and see you, right? Without having to pay for ads or anything. So really great place to start building reviews if you haven't already. So there's the sales page. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you just uh, real quick, the inside, a little bit of the back end of what we're doing here. So let me go ahead and do that. All right. And here we are guys in the back end of next door. Um, so I think I might be in my personal account. Let me have to double check here. Yeah, so we've got a Sandia Green Clean account, which is our local business account. And then, um, but I'll just give you guys kind of a, a rundown of what it looks like in the back end here. So Prospector's Ridge, that's actually the neighborhood I live in here in Albuquerque. And you can see people in here talking about all sorts of stuff. Um, sometimes, you know, most of the time it's not political and all that, like it is on Facebook and other places. It does get a little bit like that, but... For the most part, people are posting stuff on here like lost dog or cat or where can I find a good plumber or where can I find a good cleaning company, right? So people scroll through this feed, kind of like a, a social media feed, right? And um, same thing that we do on social media. We try to grab people's attention, right? Hook them in, tell them a story, give them an offer. So um, if, if as you see here, we have local deals. I'm going to scroll down to local deals. And uh, as you can see, a couple of our local deals that expired in here, okay? But I want to just zoom into one of these. So here's the one that we ran most recently. We were tracking this one properly as well. So I have good analytics on the back end as far as how many customers actually converted to customers or how many leads from next door actually converted to customers. So here's the offer. Get 50% off your first home cleaning, okay? So if you're scrolling through your next door feed, uh, what you're going to see is that offer pop up, and I'll show you an example of what that looks like here in just a second. But real simple, you know, that's essentially what it looks like. It's a saved, share, or shop online. So if people do indeed click over here to shop online, right, they're going to come to our, hmm, is it going to go there? I don't know if it's going to go up. Oh, there it goes. Um, yeah, which is weird. It's not the... Uh, we just changed this. So we're actually just about to run another deal for $87 off to test that. So as you can see, guys, we're always testing. So 
Um, but yeah, just so you know, this was not a different. This was not the same offer when they clicked on this. This would have said 50 uh, 50 percent off your first claim. So we're always testing the price points, percentage off discounts, all sorts of things to see what pulls people in. This is the offer we send them to externally. So this is actually our funnel. This is our marketing funnel. And if they click to get their special voucher, they sign in here and then they go into our funnel system. They get automatically followed up with via text, email, uh, phone messaging, all that good stuff, right? So by the time they get to our sales guy, they're totally sold. They're ready to go. They've been nurtured. And uh, also guys, just maybe notice some of the copy that we're using here, which is Again, Hey Neighbor, it's from Nextdoor, which is a neighborhood network, right? It's very focused. And then again, the whole point of this funnel is to get people to take one specific action versus take them to our website where they have 50 different things to do and they get distracted and they leave and you've lost that customer now maybe forever. Instead, we're taking them to this funnel, which again is very simple, has some social proof on there, set testimonials so people believe us. It has an offer exp expiration here, which creates urgency, a little bit of scarcity, right? Um, and then also you can actually create that scarcity and urgency, which is great marketing. You can work that into your actual offer, which we did. And you can put something on there like good for seven days only, or only for the next 15 days or 30 days, you know, make it a time sensitive offer. And beyond that, I just wanted to show you guys. So, uh, yeah, 61 neighbors saved this deal. I'm going to try to see the actual, uh, there's some other analytics on the back end of this I wanted to show you guys. So let me look for that real quick. All right, guys. So for some reason, I can't see the, the full analytics that I could see normally when the offer was running live. I don't know why they turned those off, but um, I do kind of remember from memory. So I'm going to click into this other offer. We ran this offer on Nextdoor for about one week. Buy your first home cleaning, get your second for free. Okay. That's the hook. That's what brings people in. That's what gets their attention. If you can use that marketing word free, it always helps. It's one of the most powerful marketing words there is. And um, so this one we ran for seven days. It was a super quick test, right? Very fast deal. Got 26 neighbors to save that deal. Um, if I remember correctly, within 48 hours, we had over 20,000 people that had, had viewed the deal. Okay, even though we can't see that here. Um, but over 20,000 people has viewed it. 26 saved it obviously um, and then this one we weren't tracking correctly so unfortunately I can't tell you exactly how many came from this deal but what, I, what we did again and just a side note guys if you can see this image here it's kind of kind of like what is that right they're dancing they have their gloves their masks on any image that you use you just want to make sure it's remarkable it's eye-catching it catches your interest it's not just like a your logo or something that's like blah like generic right um, so this is, this is actually a commercial that we did earlier this year in 2020 during the pandemic that kind of brought some peace of mind, some confidence that we were coming to your home to disinfect, slow the spread, keep your family safe, kind of that peace of mind and that confidence that we're uh, interesting and in, in putting forth in our messaging, right? So that is really our messaging, as you can see, is a little bit different with these offers because our messaging is during this time of year. It's a little, a little different than the normal year, right? 2020. So... Um, however, you can, uh, use this however you'd like, you can set up any kind of deal on this one. They could actually call us, which, I, which is interesting. Um, uh, however, you want to try to take them outside of next door and collect that lead, pr preferably on a funnel on a third party funnel, like we use. And that we, we teach you guys how to do in our marketing course and whatnot. Um, but, uh, the local deals here, I do want to show you this one over here, which as you can see, another somewhat eye-catching image, like lots of colors and bright and colorful and whatnot, stands out, right? So so that's that 50% off. Um, I just want to show you how many leads actually came from that. So let me go over to our marketing dashboard one second here. All right, guys. So I'm in the back of one of our marketing dashboards where we uh, most of the leads that we do from Facebook or Nextdoor are coming in here. Um, so as you can see, we have a ton of leads in here, right? Leads that just came in, leads we're talking to, scheduled an estimate, all that good stuff. And we actually teach you guys how to set this all up in our marketing course, such as how to, how to set up the back end of this, track all this. Uh, it's really an amazing little tool. But if I just go over here and click next door, uh, as you can see, this is what that campaign generated, the most recent campaign on Nextdoor, which was kind of in the midst of a 
an, an election and all this crazy stuff going on. So we might not might not have had as much results as uh, we could have. So I'm going to run another one here today. Um, but I just wanted to show you, like, you know, we actually have scheduled estimates. We have people we're still talking to. We have these leads that have come in from Nextdoor. I mean, we're tracking them from Nextdoor. So these are definitely from Nextdoor. Uh, the, the marketing budget, you know, I think we spent like $250, somewhere around there, to test this most recent campaign. We ran that over 30 days. And so if you do the math, yes, all of these haven't actually become customers yet, but, but uh, let's consider they all do because we're, we're talking to them and uh, following up with them. So three, four, five, six. So six customers from, call it two, three hundred dollars of ad spend. Each one of those customers is worth three to five thousand dollars a year for our business. Okay, those because they're most of the time they're going to become recurring customers every two weeks or once a month, whatever it might be. However, uh, as you can see, it was highly effective. We've got six leads in here, and kind of the way I like to think of it, guys, is, um, you know. Even if you didn't generate more than one or two leads, customers from this, it's still amazing, amazing branding. Okay, so as you can see here, I'm, I'm in my local next door account. There's some more local deals showing up down here, which is Ace Carpet and Janitorial and Reiki Cat Southwest. Now, first of all, guys, look at this image. It's just absolutely horrible, right? It's just, I don't even know what that is. I don't have no idea. I guess it's a carpet and tile clean, but it's just not real clear. Like when I first looked at it, now I can now seeing that it's a carpet company, but it's just not real eye catching. It's kind of like it looks like a random image, you know. And so I'm, that image is really really important. Um, some of these offers, like 15% off or 25% off, it sounds good, but you want to really test and like sometimes you're gonna have to get a little crazy and go more aggressive to create a really compelling offer. Like we're doing 50% off, buy one get one free. Those generally get a little bit more uptake because it's more interesting, right? It's a bigger discount. So think about that when you're setting up your Nextdoor ads. And then, um, again, guys, just you know, play around with Nextdoor ads. They're really cool. The local deals uh, is amazing. Um, like I said, I haven't played around too much with the local sponsorships. Uh, but other than that, you can post live to your networks uh, twice a month. You can post on here. You can do like a, a, a post. Um, so that's pretty cool. But I would just check this out. I would just see, like, it seems like they're pretty actively working on Nextdoor and launching new whatever marketing pieces on here. So I, th I think Local Deals actually launched earlier in 2020. We had been waiting for it for a couple of years, actually. So really excited to see it come out, guys. Really excited to see you guys t test it out, see how it works for you, and hopefully generate some new customers. And like I was saying, guys, if, if at the very least you're just running some promotions in your neighborhoods, it's branding, it's brand re recognition. So even if people save your deal and let's say they don't convert right away, well, you're still front of mind in that customer's head. If you're constantly running these deals in Nextdoor, when people are looking on Nextdoor for a, a local cleaning company, they're going to see you right there. Okay. Um, so have that visibility, have that presence, especially I want to say, like, I don't ever see any of the big franchises in here. I haven't since we've been advertising here. So it's low-hanging fruit. It's a, it's a great opportunity to expose your brand to the local community. These are the local neighborhoods, right? And so um, further than that, guys, I wanted to just show you um, the actual targeting. Let me see if I can find the targeting here. All right. I found the goods, guys. So I actually had to click into my account over here into the correct profile because you have to set up a personal profile and a business profile on uh, Nextdoor. So I just clicked over and switched over to my page. So sorry about that. So now I'm in here. Check out these insights. So obviously last seven days we haven't been running an offer, so it's been going down. But uh, this is the first deal that we ran. Okay, so buy your first home cleaning, get the second one free. I showed you guys that one. 84,000 views. 162 actions, right? That one only ran for a week, as you can see. We can rerun the deal if we want. This one, 378,000 people viewed this deal or saw it or something. You know, it's pretty, pretty great branding, I'd say, right? And then 287 actions. So, again, guys, even though we got six leads out of this deal, when I actually look into it, how many clicks, how many saves, how many shares, really cool analytics that you can get from this. Um, really amazing, right? And top neighborhoods, look at that. You can see, wow, that's amazing. I didn't even know they gave you that. You can see which neighborhoods are saving the deal. It looks like top neighborhoods, right? 
So that might give us some insight into which neighborhoods have interest. So you could run specific deals just targeting these neighborhoods, these uh, specific zip codes, whatever. Um, so again, guys, even if only six customers came out of all this activity, look how many people have now been exposed to our brand. Look how many people are now seeing our brand and we're, we're front of mind. I mean, that's just so powerful, right? So a lot of times with branding, people don't, they, people literally have to see your message or your branding like seven times or more in marketing in order to even recognize you, recognize your product or service and see what you have. So it's, there's just so much noise happening, especially these days with the internet and stuff. You really have to uh, figure it out just and, and think long term, big picture kind of stuff. So again, guys, even though we didn't get thousands of customers out of this deal, obviously, great, great return, I, I would say. I'd highly recommend you guys check out Nextdoor. Uh, let's see what else we can do here. So content, you can pr create a poster local deal. So that's what we've done there. There's those local deals, you can rerun them. Your reputation, this shows just straight up like what recommendations of which are reviews are in here, uh, where you're showing up on the neighborhoods, organic reach. So if I zoom out here, we're actually not even in all the neighborhoods in Albuquerque. Oh, went way too far out. But as you can see, we're, we're making our way in. Um, so if there's specific neighborhoods you want to target, and just you know have people leave you a review in those neighborhoods, and then you'll be showing up in those neighborhoods so people can find you and see you organically, naturally, right? So let's see. You can share this page to get recommendations right there. It makes it easy. Meet neighbors, make, uh, share your business story, nurture customer relationship, drive new local business, okay? So... Say hello with the post. Like, so we're, we're still getting ready to do this and test this, but um, you, get, you guys can do two posts a month. So if I click on this, uh, you know, ask a question, create a post. You can do two of these, create a post. So two remaining, it says. Try and tell and include a, a photo with your update. Headline, operating hours, keep it brief, include important details, let your personality show. So again, guys, I wouldn't like... I would I would add value in some way. You could add, you could do a survey. You could ask question. You could um, but think try to think how you could add value, right? How could you add value to people? And you can do two of those a month. We're gonna start doing that. We've been testing these local deals, and I'm pretty impressed with the results. So we're gonna keep doing that. Um, neighbor comments. You know, this is just people talking about our business, recommending us. We use Sandia Green Clean. Um, cool. You know. And the, the great thing is, guys, people are now talking about our business all the time on Nextdoor, and we don't have to jump in there. In the beginning, we had to jump in there and say, hey, you should check out our business. We, you know, Someone's asking, do you guys know of a local cleaning business? Right? So um, great, great stuff there. Here's our local business page, uh, info. You fill all this out, put some pictures, put your story on there, make it compelling, right? You can put an offering on there, put your hours. So. Anyways, guys, lots of cool stuff on nextdoor.com. Highly recommend you guys check it out. Highly recommend you start running some local deals. Uh, it's worth testing. It's, it's working for us, and I think it'll work for you guys too. So uh, I, I appreciate you guys watching this video. All the best to growing your cleaning business. And if you like learning this kind of stuff, if this sounds interesting to you, uh, check out. We've got a really cool 10x growth toolkit for local local cleaning businesses that we have it's a course and it is literally called the million dollar local uh, cleaning business 10x growth toolkit okay it's kind of a long name but that's what it is we're going to link to it in this video so you can get to it check out the course guys we're going to run through entire setup of a next door campaign start to finish um, we'll give you some offer ideas some some different copy ideas things like that so check that out we've got tons more marketing content like this so we don't just run ads like that on, like like if you come over back to our our lead thing here, all these leads did not just come from Nextdoor. They came from Facebook. Um, we've got a whole other platform that looks just like this that is totally filled up with leads from Google. Okay, so uh, we test lots of places, guys, but the ones that really work the best are what are the ones I just mentioned, Google, Facebook, and Nextdoor. Really, really cool paid advertising platforms. And again, Nextdoor, I feel like, is this, this cool new hyper local hybrid of, of everything that really allows you to target even deeper um, so check that out guys set up a local local deal and have fun with it and I think you guys are gonna get some huge value out of it so hope this video was helpful and we'll see you guys again soon until then keep it clean